Good evening, good afternoon, good morning. Welcome to the Leadership TKO Live Night Show. Welcome to the show. For those of you podcast listeners out there and all, every continent, okay, every continent, I have to say that because, man, uh, those of you throughout India, throughout Europe, Africa, Asia, South America, you all are tuning in, especially throughout the United States, tuning in to the Leadership TKO Live Night Show. And I appreciate each and every one of you dropping in, whether it's live or catching it on demand, the replay. Thank you so very much for plugging in. And so listen, as we normally do, we go live on Facebook. So please stand by as we are about to do that. Just getting it prepared, everybody, just in case you're wondering. Tagging a few people before I go live here. So I appreciate your patience. Okay, here we go. Oh, wait a minute. I think there is a... I think I have to go back and reset... Thank you so much for your patience, guys. I have to go back and reset this. It looks like there's a little bit of a hurdle there. So let's go back here and reset it so we can go live. I think we delayed too long. Thank you so much for your patience, guys. Get a notepad and a pen. I'm going to share with you some great content on tonight during this particular show. Again, appreciate your patience. Looks like <laughs> we got to speed it up when it comes to connecting Facebook to Zoom and doing the stream, we can't delay too long or it will time out and we have to do it again. So again, welcome to the show. Welcome, welcome. And I appreciate your patience for those of you who are here. So we should get ready to rock and roll in a second. Once it comes back up again and it is coming right now, we will tag a few people really quick and we will get on with this. So looks like we are good here. Going to fix some of the functions here. Give it a title as I did before. Tag or just a few people, not too many. Here we go. Bear with me a little bit. Getting a few of them in there. I'll probably add a few more a little later. All right, here we go. All right. Good evening. Good afternoon. Good morning, everyone. Welcome. For those of you on Facebook, welcome to the Leadership TKO Live Night Show. It's Lakeisha McKnight, your leadership specialist, wealth mentor, author of a few books, Facebook marketing coach. Let's not forget that. All right. But most importantly, out of all of those, I am your friend. And so listen, I welcome you here to the show. Thank you so very much for joining in with me tonight. Uh, you could be doing a number of different things, especially I know, you know, the world, of course, celebrates this holiday season and, you know, you could be doing a number of different things, but you've decided to be here with me on tonight. And I appreciate that. And so remember this show goes live every single night around 7.30 PM Eastern standard time, 7.30. So if you want to catch this live, remember to set your alarm. All right, so you can join and meet me here. For the most part, we stream right uh, onto the Facebook platform. If Facebook is not having its issues connecting to a third-party uh, program or software. So nonetheless, we are here. 
<laughs> okay? Now remember, the purpose of the show really is to empower leaders like you with the ability to win from the inside out, growing your influence your impact, and your income. So I'm not sure how many of you out there really truly want to grow your ability to lead because I honestly believe that in everything that we do, right, the foundation should be leadership, should be enhancing yourself as a leader, whether you are a man or woman, male or female, we should be working on enhancing ourselves because everything, like my mentor, Dr. John Maxwell says, Everything rises and falls upon leadership, leadership, okay? And he says that leadership is influence. And we had a three-part series this past week about influence. So if you missed that, you want to check that out. You want to go back to the past streams from this week and tune into those because they, I believe they're really good. They're really, really good. And so again, welcome aboard we're here to help you in the area of your influence, your impact, and your income. And there are several ways that I do encourage you to participate with this show. So number one, like or love the stream if that's something you want to do. If you want to grow yourself as a leader, if you want to enhance and grow your income, you want to plug in here. Secondly, we do have a comment section below, okay? So what you can do is just interact with one another. Say hello. Greet the others who are tuning in. And listen, if you're catching the replay, please remember to put hashtag replay below in the comment section. Let me know as well what city, what state, and what country, for those of you outside of the United States, let me know what country you are tuning in from. I love to meet new people. I've studied in the field of what psychology and social sciences for some time. I know the importance of connecting and building relationship. So please go ahead and do that. I love to meet people from different cultures, different places around the world. And so go ahead and do that. And then the last way to engage while we're here, you can actually share this out onto your timeline, a group, a fan page, a direct message. Okay, go ahead and share this out. And so I'm excited right now. And the reason why I'm excited, let me just share this first before diving into the topic. I've had an amazingly full day. Can I just give props and kudos where kudos is due? I just want to say thank you to the leaders of Wealth Builders Worldwide. Okay, Wealth Builders Worldwide, specifically Mr. Roger Williams, Big Pill, some people know him as. Also, I'm going to call him Dr. Michael Delco. <laughs> okay, Mr. Michael Delco. Uh, he's just, man, if you don't know him, you need to. Okay, you need to. So kudos to him. We've had an amazing boot camp. And this is, you know, we call it the next level boot camp uh, because of some of the things that we do. And I'll hint and I'll maybe share some information about that towards the end of the stream. But I want you to pay close attention to a couple of things. One thing is look at the title of the stream tonight, the title. And I'm about to share this as well. I like to be an example because I've asked you to share it. And so I'm going to share this as well. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. Share it to one, two chat areas. And good evening to all of my Wealth Builders Worldwide family members. Good evening to you. So listen, looking at the title of the message, you know, what prevents most entrepreneurs? And when I say entrepreneurs, for those of you viewing, I'm talking about those of you who are online marketers, okay? Building a business online, you could be an affiliate marketer, you could be a network marketer, okay? You could be someone, a research entrepreneur selling lipstick, whatever it is that you might be doing, okay? You are leveraging, trying to leverage social media, specifically Facebook, with growing your business. Now, one of the things that I realized, and some of you may have encountered this, and you can let me know if you have, has anyone ever sent you a friend request and then immediately, they don't say hello, they immediately say, you know what, I have something that you might want to take a look at. You, you look like a sharp person, so I, you know, I like connecting with sharp people like you, and so I wanted to just send you this link. Hold. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> now, if you've been in the industry for some time, if you've been an online uh, business owner for some time, you already know when uh, a message starts like that, you know what's about to proceed it and what spot, what's to follow. That is a link or some type of offer, right? How many of you know you've, you kind of picked up on the clues when that happens? Now, 
I know it's not going to prevent people from doing it, but one thing I've come to understand is that if you're trying to build a home-based business or build a business online, it's really about building relationships, okay? Establishing relationships. Say hi, hello. Now, it doesn't mean that you have to take like two, three, three months <laughs> to build the relationship before you invite someone to take a look at what you have, but at least start somewhere, build a relationship, and maybe not on the first hello, would you say, hey, I have an offer, take a look at this. That is the wrong way to approach building a relationship and sharing an opportunity with me. Because one thing you need to find out is, what is my struggle? What, what, what Do I really need what you have? And I know some people may say, well, I really don't care, so I'm just going to send the link anyway. You see, what normally happens for me when someone sends me an offer and they don't say hello, what normally happens is I say, you know what, thank you so very much. One thing I definitely prefer is building a relationship. And if the individual proceeds to continue to share an offer or go hard at selling something, either you, I see and I perceive you are ignoring what I'm saying. And then the next thing that I may have to do is either unfriend you or block you. Can I just be and have that real moment? <laughs> okay. I don't know how many of you have ever experienced that where someone's just going in, they're going hard on messenger and they just like throwing their offer. You're like, wait, I just said, let's connect and build a relationship. And you're continuing to throw your offer at me. Okay. So it means again, that you're not listening to what I'm saying. Okay. So listen, the correct effective way to do it, even if you have a launch, because right now, for example, uh, my wealth building family, we are a part of a soft launch of an amazing resource we're sharing with people. And I'm going to go into that in just a second. But you want to really connect with those people you're connected to already, especially if you're launching something, right? So people you're connected to, you have you have their number saved in your phone. You have a list from a previous business that you've had and you have their contact information, go ahead and run with them. Maybe you've been connected with some of your Facebook friends for some time and you can approach them with the opportunity. But if you've newly just recently connected with someone, throwing your offer at them is inappropriate. <laughs> it's inappropriate. And if you want to find a quick way to get blocked or unfriended, then of course you can continue to do that. I'm just saying, and I know a lot of people have picked up on it. I'm just telling you the truth. People do not, they do not receive that very well. Okay. They don't receive it very well. So you want to get to know people. You want to share more about yourself, connect. And so what I'm going to take a moment to do, just share with you a little bit about myself, right? Cause I know that I've connected with many of you recently. Some of you I just met, you know, today or yesterday or last this past week. Some of you are part of the John Maxwell team. Some of you, you know, you're just other Facebook friends that I've connected with. And so again, nice to meet you virtually, right? Uh, but there are certain things I do want to share with my share with you about myself and feel free, okay? In the comment section, share with me a little bit about yourself. For example, I'll share that I am a December baby. Yes, my birthday is in this month, okay? It's not on Christmas, okay? It's not on Christmas but it is in this month of December, and I really, really enjoy this month. I love, I love just being able to stuck, snuggle up in a warm blanket, watch a movie, which has some lessons to it, okay, during my downtime. Not a lot, okay? I used to be just like this movie buff, but not a lot, okay? I like, that's just my downtime, to be able to just, you know, escape for just a second, okay? And so the other thing is that I am originally born and raised in New Jersey, but moved to Virginia. So I'm a resident of Virginia, but I am originally from New Jersey, just outside of New York City. All right. So that's where I'm originally from. For those of you New Yorkers out there, I had to get my New York, New York accent. <laughs> okay. So listen, I am definitely proud to be a Northerner, but at the same time, I like the slower pace of Virginia. So I'm here right now with my husband and my two children. I do have a background in acting. Some of you probably know that. Okay, I've probably shared that. I've done acting for about four years. And, and so I really, that's where I got my foundation of speaking and communicating and things of that nature. And so there you have it. That's another point about me. I recently joined the doctor club. 
Okay, I was honored with a doctorate in divinity just recently. And again, I just want to say thank you to Heart Bible Institute University for that amazing, amazing honor. And so Apostle McIntosh, uh, Dr. Grant, and all others who participated in the ceremony, again, thank you so very much for that honor. My color, a color, like if I was to say a color, some people say, what is your favorite color? I definitely enjoy the color green, more specifically candy apple green. Okay. <laughs> That's just so that you'll know. I know I don't wear a lot of green, but when I wear it, I wear it like eyeshadow, jewelry, like I wear it <laughs> completely. It's all in. It's either in all or nothing when it comes to green. Okay. All or nothing. Now, another point that I do want to share is that I have traveled to four continents. I've traveled throughout four continents. For those of you who are excited, I don't know, where have you traveled? What are some exciting places where you've gone? Share with me a little bit about that in the comment section. An amazing place that you've traveled to. I've traveled, of course, throughout the United States. I've traveled in, you know, in Europe. I've traveled in Africa. I've traveled in Asia. All right, so these are just some places I particularly, I do enjoy Switzerland. It's very serene, very clean. I love it. Uh, I definitely enjoyed my time several times in Africa. And so these, I, I'm a traveler. I love to travel. Of course, uh, the global pandemic has really hampered some of that, kind of decreased a lot of that. But once all of this begins to slowly subside, it's not going to happen that fast, but when it slowly subsides, definitely we'll be able to get back into the traveling scene. So excited about that. And listen, one other thing that I would like to share is that I have two amazing children, but these two children will never need to work a job, ever, ever. I don't know how many moms and dads are watching this stream and how many of you actually have a place of employment, a job or some sort that you have to uh, report to, but wouldn't it be great to position yourself for you? I don't know what your goals are. But for you to not have to go to a job, a J-O-B, if, if you want to be free from the job, to not be able to have to go there, wouldn't it be nice for your children to not have to work a job? They might, of course, decide to do whatever it is they want to do, but to give them that option not to have to work a job, wouldn't it be great to bring in consistent revenue, or I should say residual income, even while you're asleep? You see, that's what my husband and I have been able to accomplish. All we do, you know, the major thing of as far as what we do, we take, you know, Federal Reserve notes like this. We take notes like this and we protect it. We exchange it for gold, as you can see, right? Gold, silver, okay? Because this is, this is actually real money. This is divine. This is God's money here. Gold, silver, commodities, precious metals that will protect, okay, protect what you work so hard for, for those of you who are, you know, you have a job or you're self-employed. And then also to be able to be connected to a resource that actually pays you in the number one cryptocurrency, which is Bitcoin. You, yes, my husband and I, we get paid in Bitcoin while we sleep. And that's amazing. Okay, it may be fractions of Bitcoin, but it's accumulating. It's accumulating because we're serving other people. We're expanding our portfolio. We're positioning people so that very soon they'll be able to acquire, you know, the gold and the silver and the diamonds and many other uh, uh, assets. And so that's what we're doing. We're simply doing that. And we have access to a resource positioning people to get paid right? On a consistent basis, instantly with Bitcoin. Now, let me ask you this question before I wrap it up. How many of you watching this stream tonight, right? You're getting paid in Bitcoin. I don't want, don't answer, don't answer below. I want you to answer it to yourself. How many of you are getting paid in Bitcoin? But here's my other question for all of my new connectors, my new Facebook friends and such. How many of you would, would like to get paid in Bitcoin? While you're sleeping, while you're spending time with your family, while you're out and about, while you're enjoying Christmas, how many of you would like to get paid in Bitcoin? 
reply Bitcoin below. Okay, I just want you to go ahead and, and, and type in Bitcoin. And even for those of you who may be connected, but you're trying to get yourself going and getting paid in Bitcoin, go ahead and reply Bitcoin below. Because for those of you who reply Bitcoin, I'm going to do something great for you. I'm going to send you some information, only information so that you can review it and you can make a decision for yourself if you want to get paid in Bitcoin. That's right. It's your decision. You don't have to get paid in Bitcoin. You can continue to get paid in this wherever you are. But understand, you got to do your homework. I want you to take a look at this. Okay, let's see where it is. So I'm pointing the right way. Right here, Federal Reserve Note. What that simply means is that it's a debt note, which means that, it's, it, first of all, it's not. it doesn't mean that it's wealth and it's not money. Okay, and the value of this is decreasing because of many factors. And I know we can talk about that separately, but please understand you have the prime opportunity now to get paid in Bitcoin, position yourself to get paid consistently in Bitcoin. So that's what I wanted to share with you. My husband and I, we were wealth mentors. We help people to get paid residually with Bitcoin and Ethereum. We help people to acquire precious metals. Uh, and we, we, we're authors. Okay. My husband and I, we first we authored, or I should say co-authored our first book, right, entitled Breakthrough Success. And you can find that over at meetthemcnights.com. So these are just some things about me. And I would love to learn more about you gradually along the way. So feel free to share something about yourself. No links, <laughs> no links, but you can share some things about yourself in the comments area. I would love to connect and learn more. So I appreciate you guys. Uh, thank you so very much for plugging in and meeting me here on the timeline here on Facebook. We'll be back tomorrow night, 7.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So until then, I encourage each and every one of you to think, to speak, and to live leadership. Good night, everyone, and God bless.